Wayne, how can I afford to send my kid to college? In this case, for me, it would be kids because I have two. So we would love to hear that. College is very expensive. And if you don't start saving early, uh, you're going to get behind the eight ball right off the bat. So the key, I think, is to start saving as soon as they're born, if you can. I have clients call me sometimes that the baby isn't doesn't have a social security number yet. So you can't start till they have a social security number. But once they have that, you can start saving. Uh, using a, a tax advantage plan like a 529 college savings plan is a, is a great way to do it because the money will grow. And then any growth in that, you don't have to pay taxes on if you use it for college tuition or you know, expenses. Other than saving early, I would also suggest letting relatives know. I have quite a few clients whose grandparents are saving for the kids. And a lot of times at birthdays and Christmas, they just put some extra money into their college savings account. So that's a great way to, to build that fund up. Uh, the graphic on the screen shows some top categories and the inflation rates in those. And if you notice the blue bar at the bottom is the cost of college. Over the last 20 years, that inflation rate is over 6%, which even is higher than, than medical costs. So that just tells you how fast the, the, the cost of college is, is increasing. Other ways that you could uh, save for college or, or plan to pay for college would be maybe encouraging your child to go to community college for two years and getting, getting two years of college at a, at a reduced rate because it's a lot less expensive to, to go to community college. And then there's always loans, grants, and scholarships that they can apply for. So meeting with a financial advisor and getting a plan together early is the, the key to saving for college so that you can afford it. Mm -hmm.